Hi user DHB5. My name is Phoenix. I'm a Helsinki based Squarespace developer. I read your post here on the Squarespace subreddit and I, uh, it just sounded horrible. You had your business, your portfolio. Um, I, I'm, from what I gathered, you were making your living or most of it or some of it this way. And basically overnight it just disappeared because of this stupid user interface problem. I'm gonna take a moment and do my best to help you out. You mentioned you had tried other developers. Um, I'm, I can't guarantee that I can give you a solution, but I've made my profile kind of solving the quote unquote impossible Squarespace problems. That's why people come to me. So uh, out of the bat, I'm just gonna suggest one possible solution. Uh, this might not work, but just the first idea I have. So one possible solution in Squarespace 7.1 would be that you would create this shop page. So it would look like a normal shop page. And when we click on any of the products here, we have the pagination to the next and previews. So did I understand correctly that this is what was missing? Also, I added the see more products uh, thing to all my products to even improve the availability of, of the other products when a visitor is checking out a specific product. So I hope uh, I understood your problem correctly because this could be a possible solution. It's, it, it takes a little bit of effort to implement, but uh, I would recommend trying this out if it could uh, kind of save your business for a while until you figure out a better solution. So how did I do this? Well, this shop page that you're checking and these products aren't actually a shop page or products, they are a blog. So this is a blog page and these are blog posts. Simple as that. Made some simple CSS edits to add the prices here and here, um, I'll show you just briefly. So as you can see, the shop page is a blog and the products are blog posts. So this way we could, for example, get the pagination. Uh, it takes indeed a little bit of effort, but uh, this was an older example for another thing. But uh, the buy now button could then be, uh, you could add the buy now button by adding a product, a block, and simply hiding the image title, maybe even the price if you have it other ways, but you could have the, basically you can use the product button to create just the uh, add to cart button on the page. And then you would have your actual products page hidden somewhere here. So you would create your store and this is like your real store, which is not visible. Just my first idea. I really want to help you out because the situation sounded horrible. Let me know if uh, this could work. And if it doesn't, let me know why. And I'll do my best to suggest some other options because I think there are other options for this. Okay, thanks for watching. I hope this was in any way helpful. And uh, also, if any one of you wants to hire a pro Squarespace developer, then feel free to hit me up. Thanks.